so much to learn about It'll make you want to shout Blippi! Hey, hey, hey! Look at where I'm at now! Right now, I'm at Cares in Burien, Washington. Yeah! C-A-R-E-S! Cares! Yeah! Cares is an animal shelter. Yeah, this is where the animals live until maybe someone like you comes down to then adopt the pet. These pets need a new home. Let's see what pets are inside. Do you see this dog? Yeah, this is a really small dog. It's kind of like a baby dog. <laughs> yeah, really small dogs like this. These are called puppies. <laughs> Here you go. This is Sapphire. Oh, she's such a cute kitty. Hey, Sapphire. How are you? Oh, she's so soft. This is Cuddles. <laughs> she loves to cuddle. Oh, she's so soft. And she loves to play. That was so much fun spending some time at my local animal shelter. Well, hey, even if you can't adopt a pet, you can still come down and volunteer your time. Yeah, you can come on down and pet the pets. Maybe they'll even let you walk a pooch <laughs> or play with a cat in the little cat room. <laughs> well, that was so much fun. <laughs> Right now, I'm at Pause and Relax in Burien, Washington. Yeah, it's a daycare. Ooh, Lino, does that feel good? <laughs> yeah, a daycare that has a playground. You know, a playground that you get to play at? Yeah, this is a doggy playground, and Lino and I are playing here. Hey, I have an idea. Why don't we let Lino run around? Whoa! And playgrounds are a lot more fun when there's a lot of friends. <laughs> Let's bring on some doggy friends. <laughs> Whoa, look at how many friends Lino has. Okay, now it's time for Lino's bath and haircut. Oh, I bet he's going to feel so clean and so fresh after this. <laughs> All right, let's take him inside. Here we go, Lino. Check it out. Look at this pink platform. Yeah, this is what all the pooches stand on. And this is a nice purple belly strap right here. And then a neck strap. Yeah, this is called a groomer's helper. So then it makes sure that the pooch doesn't fall off the table while it's getting groomed. Hey, come check this out. Whoa, see this toolbox? 
there's a lot of things that the groomers use inside this toolbox. Wow, that is so cool. All right, first we have some shampoo. This is plum flavored shampoo. <laughs> Ooh, and it looks like we have some clippers up here. Whoa. <laughs> That's what you put on the dog's hair, and then it trims it. Ooh, this files down the nails of the dog. Let's turn it on. Whoa. <laughs> That's silly. Okay. Wow. Yeah, these, yeah, these are like scissors. Yeah but they're actually called shears. Wow, a dog's hair is a lot more fine than a human's hair. And these scissors can really cut a dog's hair really good. So let's put these on the platform. Let's put the, the red colored ones. Okay, gotta be really careful if you use these shears. Perfect, <laughs> okay. What else do we need to cut Lino's hair? Hmm, let's see. Oh, <laughs> hey, do you want a haircut? <laughs> hey, do you want a haircut? <laughs> <laughs> Looks like their hair's already cut. Oh, look at this. Wow, a comb. Yeah, just like how you and I comb our hair and brush our hair, dogs need that too. Wow. <laughs> oh, hello. <laughs> okay, let's put this on the platform. Okay, next to the pair of shears. All right, what else is over here? Whoa, looks like we have some sanitation spray. So then when Lino's done, you sanitize everything. So then the next dog can get its hair cut. Whoa, sugar cookies. I love sugar cookies. This is sugar cookie dog perfume. <laughs> this definitely should go over there. Check this out. Another drawer. Wow. There is a lot of cool things in this. Look at that. That kind of looks like a brush, but it doesn't look like a normal brush or a comb. This is called a slicker brush. <laughs> All right. We'll put that over there as well. Whoa, this is gonna be so much fun. Let's see. Remember from earlier these clippers up here? Yeah, see this? These are clipper attachments. You put them on the top and then that is what determines the length of hair. See that compared to way shorter. <laughs> okay, let's bring this and a green attachment. Whoa. <laughs> All right. I think we have everything we need <laughs> to cut Lino's hair. All right. So we have clippers, shears, scissors, <laughs> A comb, some dog perfume, <laughs> and a slicker brush. There's a lot more things in there that we'll probably use, but for now, this is good. <laughs> yeah! <laughs> Whoa, look at Lino! They took off so much hair. Look! <laughs> Whoa! This is a bunch of Lino's hair. <laughs> wow, it's so soft. Ah, oh, yeah, I could make a pillow out of this. Woo! <laughs> wow! <laughs> hey! <laughs> you like Lino's hair? Does it smell good? <laughs> it's so silly. Oh, look, Lino's all done. <laughs> How does he look? 
Look at those big fluffy ears. <laughs> Whoa! <laughs> wow! Woo! And look at his spooky bandana! <laughs> oh, there's some pumpkins on it. Ooh, and it looks like a llama with a cape. <laughs> wow. All right, Lino. We can go home now. <laughs> All right. Bye-bye. <laughs> well, this is the end of this video. But if you want to watch more of my videos, all you have to do is search for my name. Will you spell my name with me? Ready? B-L-I-P-P-I. Blippi. Good job. All right. Bye-bye. <laughs> Ooh, hey, hey, it's me, Blippi. And today, I'm at the Hands-On Children's Museum in Olympia, Washington. And I am so excited because this place, you get to learn so much. <laughs> Let's go. gonna use tape. All right, now we have the body of the rocket. Okay, now we need to make fins just like this. Hmm, let's see here. How do we do this? <laughs> I don't know. <laughs> All right, let's cut them. Used to be a big rectangle, but now I'm gonna go like this. made a triangle. Okay, now let's fold it like that. Okay, there's one. Now, now we have another triangle. Yeah. Okay, fold that. So now we can tape these fins on the body of the rocket. Ah, that tape is really tough. Okay. Okay, there's one fin. How does that look? Really good. Then we'll do a fin on the other side. There we go. Yeah, how does that look? That looks really good. <laughs> now we need to do the nose cone. We can use the same piece of paper. All right, so it looks like we do a little circle. But then, 
we go like this. It's kind of a circle on one side, half circle, and then makes a point. So then, looks like you roll it up, just like that. Perfect. Now, ah, we can take this. Whoa, we're almost done. All right, now let's tape this to the rocket. <laughs> My rocket. Ah, doesn't look that good, but we'll see how it flies. <laughs> let's also take some of these from previous people. And maybe one of these will fly really good, just in case if mine doesn't fly. This one looks like it might fly really good. We'll bring this right over there. Okay, this is the launch pad. So first thing you have to do is put it right on the launch pad. All right, this is the rocket that I made. And then we need to pressurize it. There we go. All right, and this is the launch button. I'm gonna launch it. Five, four, three, two, one. Whoa! Oh, we did it! Yeah, good job! That was the rocket that you and I made. All right, and remember that rocket that we grabbed from the recycling bin? <laughs> Let's see how good this person's rocket goes. All right, okay. Ooh, that's on there nice and snug. Gotta pressurize it. Woo! T minus five, four, three, two, one, zero! Oh! Hey, look! <laughs> Maybe that's why it was in the recycling bin. <laughs> That's so silly. <laughs> hey, come on. Whoa, this looks like an art studio. Whoa, and check that out. That looks like a homemade robot. That's pretty cool. Yeah, that is art because someone made it. Ooh, even a sink. So then you can wash your hands. So you might get a little dirty in the art studio. Whoa. This area is really cool because it has hot glue guns. They're turned off right now, but it melts this glue really hot. And then you can glue things like that really quick. Whoa, hey, look at these. These are art pieces that other kids made. Wow, they look so beautiful and so colorful. Whoa, let's keep exploring. I love creating things. <laughs> oh! Oh, hey! Hi! Who are you? My name is Bryn. Ooh, that's a nice name. Welcome to the Make Space. Ooh, the Make Space? Whoa! What do you do at the Make Space? Here we can make all sorts of arts and crafts. We can build robots, we can do some painting, we can even do some drawing and coloring. Whoa! That sounds like fun. Do you have an art project that I can do? We sure can. Would you like to build a crown? Oh, sure. This right here, you can take that and go ahead and decorate how you would like it. <laughs> All right, thank you so much. Bye-bye. All right, let's make a crown together. Wow. All right, so let's take this. And it looks like we take these yellow things and wrap it around our head. Oh, wait, it's not big enough. Wait a second, I have an idea. Let's take this stapler and staple two together, just like that. And now, it can definitely wrap all the way around my head. So let's make sure it's the correct size. Perfect. There we go. There we go. Now, I have some extra that I'm gonna take a pair of scissors and cut off the extra. Yeah, see? Now, it's a circle, and this will fit on my head. Yeah, just like that. All right, let's put the extra back in here. And now, we get to use all of these things to decorate. So, it's 
put the stapler back, and now let's take this marker and color some blue squigglies on it. Yeah, that looks really nice. Ooh, yeah. Hmm, what other color? Maybe a purple marker. And we'll do some squigglies, but the other opposite way. Whoa. And we'll go And then this side, we'll do zigzags. Wow. Down the middle. Ooh, and we'll do some black. Whoa, this is looking so good. There we go. Okay, now we have some yellow things that are are uh, nice and soft. Tickle, tickle, tickle. <laughs> that tickled me. Okay, let's put some yellow things right here, just like that. See that? Yeah, this is looking really good. Good job. Okay, another one. Wow. We'll do third one. Perfect. There we go. Move those like that. All right. How is this looking? Really good. <laughs> I bet I know one thing that's missing. I think it's missing a flower. <laughs> okay, I'll put that right there. How do I look? <laughs> now you can call me King Blippi! <laughs> Woohoo! <laughs> Good job being creative. <laughs> tickets! Get your tickets! <laughs> Who wants a ticket to my show? <laughs> yeah, I'm selling tickets to my show. <laughs> Do you want to see my routine? Yeah! It's going to be really funny. Okay, I got to go backstage and get ready. Meet me back there, okay? Oh no, this isn't good. I'm not prepared at all. Oh, okay. Okay, Blippi, you got this. Blippi, you got this. Okay, okay, I got this. Ladies and gentlemen, Blippi! Figure out something fast. in Olympia, Washington. <laughs> well, this is the end of this video. But if you want to watch more of my videos, all you have to do is spell my name. Yeah, will you spell my name with me? B-L-I-P-P-I. -I. Blippi. Good job. <laughs> hey, it's me, Blippi. And today, we're here at Great Explorations Children's Museum in St. Petersburg, Florida. <laughs> yeah! And I can't wait to see what's inside and start playing. Whoa! Come on! 
Whoa, look where we're at. The Sandy Shack. <laughs> yeah, it's a really big sandbox and you and I get to go inside. <laughs> but first, we gotta take off our shoes. One, two. <laughs> okay, I'll put these to the side and we can go inside. Don't forget your bucket. Whoa, look at it. Whoa, whoa. <laughs> it's so cool in here. It's really sandy. There's so much sand here. And it's a good thing we have our pail and shovel. Yeah, we have two blue shovels. We can pick up sand. And we have one, two, three different pails. Yeah, this one is the color yellow. This one is the color orange. And this one is the color red. <laughs> yeah, these are really helpful for scooping sand up. Whoa, and making a sand castle. Okay, let's try it out. <laughs> Uh-oh, it looked like our sand castle didn't stand up, but that's okay. Sometimes when you're trying to make something, it doesn't work on the first time, so you gotta just keep trying. <laughs> Whoa, this is pretty cool. Whoa, but do you see these animals? Whoa, do you know what kind of animal this is? It's kind of hiding in the sand. <laughs> yeah, this animal is a crab. Ooh, <laughs> he's feeling a little crabby. <laughs> so silly. Well, this crab is really cool. Hey, do you know how crabs like to move? Uh-huh, yeah, they don't like to walk like us. They like to go side to side. Hey, will you act like a crab with me? <laughs> yeah. Okay, here we go. Let's do a crab walk. Whoa, <laughs> moving side to side like a crab is so much fun. <laughs> yeah, but look at this. There's another animal. Whoa, this animal is really big and likes to live on beaches just like a crab in the sand. This, yeah, this guy. He's a sea turtle. Whoa, and look how big his shell is. Whoa, it's bigger than my head. Whoa, this is so much fun playing in the sand. Woo, woo, woo. Maybe we can make a sand angel. Okay, here we go. Whoa, <laughs> that was so much fun playing in the sand with you. Whew. Gotta dust myself off because I'm pretty sandy now. <laughs> Let's go keep exploring. But first, we gotta put our shoes on. And now that we have our shoes on, all we have to do is tie them. Yeah, do you know how to tie your shoes? Yeah, they can be really, really hard tying your shoes. But this is how I like to tie them. So I take my laces, and first I cross them over, and I take one of the laces, and I put it through the center. Yeah, like that. And I pull it tight. Once I've done the first step, then I take the laces and I make cute little bunny ears. Yeah, just like this. You see my two little bunny ears? Hop, 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 hop. <laughs> it's so cute. Yeah. And then I take the bunny ears and they give each other a little hug. They wrap around and then I pull that tight too. Okay, this time I'll do it a little faster. Okay, we take our laces cross them and then one lace goes under then one bunny ear two bunny ears Woo! <laughs> and we cross them we then wrap that one through to give it a little hug and we pull it tight whoa look at that we tied our shoes and sometimes i like to do it again to double knot my shoes because i like to dance and i like to run and play and you don't want to play or dance when your shoes are untied, because then you might trip on your shoelace. That wouldn't be very fun. <laughs> well, there's so much more to explore. Come on! There are so many cool things here. <laughs> Look at this really big circle. Hello! Woo! Woo! <laughs> Whoa! And look at this over here. There are so many cubes. <laughs> Whoa, there are so many different colors on these cubes. Look, we have the color white and the color red. 
and the color purple and the color blue. <gasps> Wait a minute. If I turn it this way, my two favorite colors, blue and orange. Hey, and look over here. There's like a little diorama playset and there's all kinds of cool animals like a little piggy. Oink, 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 oink. <laughs> Woo, he's gonna walk on the bridge. Oh, and look, there are two sheep. Yeah, one, two. And you know what sound sheep make? Yeah, they go like this. Bah, bah. <laughs> and they're also gonna be on the bridge because they're friends with Mr. Piggy. Okay, right there. Whoa, and look at this. There are three animals here. One, two, three. Do you know what kind of animals these are? Yeah, they're little lambs, and they're so cute and tiny. Woo. <laughs> they're gonna hang out near the bridge too. Whoa, and look at this. There are four really big cows. Moo, moo, moo. <laughs> yeah. One, two, three, four. Whoa, four really big cows, <laughs> and they're gonna go they're gonna go in the water. They're taking a little bath, because it's really warm out. <laughs> Ooh. Ooh. <laughs> Ooh. Hello, Mr. Pig. Hello, Mr. Cow. Hello. <laughs> <Whoa>. ah. <laughs> so silly. That was really fun, playing with all those foam cubes and seeing about those animals. Hey, look over here. Whoa. And look at this. Have you ever seen one of these before? Yeah, this is called an abacus. Mm -hmm. And it's really good helping do math or arithmetic. Mm -hmm. Look, you can do it like this. One yellow lemon plus one yellow lemon. Hmm, how many lemons does that make? Yeah, two lemons. Okay, that was pretty easy. But now you can do an even harder one. What about two apples plus three apples? Whoa, that's a lot harder. Let's count them. One, two, three, four, five. Whoa, two plus three apples is five apples. Whoa. Yeah, abacus is really helpful for counting and math. These are really, really big. There's a watermelon and a pumpkin. <laughs> and the pumpkin's my favorite color, orange. Hmm, I wonder what these are. Whoa. In a watermelon, it's a watermelon drum. Well, that means that the pumpkin's a drum too. Whoa, <laughs> they sounded really cool. Whoa. Those are awesome fruit drums. <laughs> yeah. Whoa, look at this over here. Whoa, look at all these different fruits and vegetables. Yeah, we have. Lettuce, onion, corn, potato, carrot, whoa, and tomato. Those are so many different kinds. Now, what we can do is play a really fun game where we take all the foods in this basket and we have to match them to the right word. So first, we got some onions. So let's see, one onion, two onion. <laughs> Got it, that was pretty easy. Next, we got two red tomatoes. Ooh, hmm, where should the red tomatoes go? Here? Hmm, here? <laughs> yeah, that's right, we'll put them right over here. Okay, here we go, one, two. Okay, we got a couple more. Whoa, what about this? Wow, there's a lot of things here. Wait a minute, where should we put this lettuce? It says lettuce here, but there are four parts and only two holes. Wait a minute, these are halves. So if you take one half and another half, and you put them together, you get one whole. One whole head of lettuce. <laughs> and we have two over here, so one half and one half, one half and one half, two whole heads of lettuce. We'll put them in the holes. One, two, <laughs> and we have 
two heads of corn. Whoa, and look at this. We have some yummy carrots. <laughs> I love carrots, and so do a lot of animals, like rabbits and horses. Ooh, ooh, <laughs> it looks like I have bunny ears with my carrots. Woo, 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 <laughs> that's so fun. Okay, we'll put two carrots, one carrot, and two carrots. Hmm, what's left? Oh yeah, a potato! Whoa, look, we got one potato right here, and we have another potato right, wait a minute, is this a potato? <laughs> that's not a potato, that's a donut, so silly. <laughs> well, I guess we'll put it in the potato because we only have one potato, but this, not a potato. <laughs> Whoa, we did a really good job matching all the fruit together. Well, there's so much more to explore, come on. Whoa, I just came out of this really awesome treehouse. Hey, let's explore it a little. Whoa, look at it. This is so big. This tree is enormous. Yeah, look, it's so big that they built a house under the tree, or in the tree, and a house above the tree. Whoa, this is such a cool tree house. I think you and I should go up in it. Come on. Look at this place, it's so amazing. And look at this, this isn't any tree house. This is Longo's Cove. And look at this, this is a pirate ship. Whoa, someone put this big pirate ship up in the tree. Hello, pirates. <laughs> Whoa, I'm so excited, let's climb up. But I have a really good idea. How about you and I count all the steps on our way up? <laughs> Here we go. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven. There's some more over here. Eight, nine, 10, 11, whoa, 12. <gasps> we made it up all the stairs and it was 12. That was a lot. <sighs> whoa, check this out. Do you know what this is right here? Yeah, this is called a spyglass, and this will help us see really far away. Whoa, I can see so far from here. <laughs> and hey, look at this. Can you find these birds? Yeah, there's all different birds over on the wall and hiding in all different places, and we can use the spyglass to see if we can find them. Okay, we wanna find an osprey, a roseate spoonbill, a brown pelican, blue herons, sandwich terns, and anhingas. Ooh, that sounds like a really cool bird. Let's see if we can find them. Okay, I'm looking. Whoa, I think I found the anhinga. He's right over there. Whoa, and I see a blue heron. <laughs> hey, right up against the blue wall. And, yeah, look. There's the sandwich turn. Whoa, that was amazing. Looking for all those different birds. Hey, do you know where all those birds like to live? <laughs> yeah, they live in a place called an estuary. Whoa, estuary is a really fancy word, but it basically means where the ocean meets a river. Woo, <laughs> yeah. Hey, I have a fun game. Do you think that an estuary has salty water or fresh water without any salt? Hmm. <laughs> yeah, you're all right because it's both salty and fresh. It's kind of, kind of salty. <laughs> yeah, and we call that brackish water. Whoa, that's another big word. <laughs> but it's amazing because all these cool birds and some really cool fish like to live there. <laughs> yeah. Whoa, this tree house is pretty amazing. Let's see what else we can find. <laughs> Whoa, look at this place. Do you see above me? Whoa, it's a captain's wheel. Whoa, I bet this came from the pirate ship. Whoa, that is so cool. I wish we could ride a real pirate ship into the ocean. Whoa, hey. It looks like there's a lot of types of trash in this treehouse. Huh, yeah, 
And it says over here, don't pollute. Mm -hmm. Have you ever heard of recycling? Yeah, it's really good because recycling helps to take care of the animals that live in the ocean and on land. <laughs> yeah. If you ever have trash, make sure it goes in the recycling bin or a trash can and not in the water. Mm -mm. <laughs> well, this treehouse is pretty cool, but I'm gonna see if I can go climb up to the top. I'll see you soon. Whoa! That was so much fun, <laughs> but I'm a little bit dizzy. <laughs> Whoa! Hey, I have a really fun idea. How about you and I go up to the pirate ship in Longo's Cove and ride the big yellow slide? <laughs> yeah, come on, let's go. Whoa, <laughs> it looks like we've been here before. Okay, we went that way, so now let's go this way. <laughs> This is so cool. Look at this place. <laughs> this treehouse is kind of spooky. Ooh. <laughs> well, I had so much fun with you today exploring the Sandy Shack and Longo's Cove. <laughs> it was so much fun. And now for the very best part, we go down the big yellow slide. Okay, I think I'm ready. On your mark, get set. And go, Blippi. Woo! <laughs> Bye-bye! Woo! Whoa! That was so much fun! <laughs> wow, I had a really great time playing with you today here at Great Explorations Children's Museum in St. Petersburg, Florida. And we had a really fun time playing in the sand in the Sandy Shack and climbing all the way to the top of Longo's Cove. Whoa! <laughs> Well, that's the end of this video, but if you want to watch more of my videos, all you have to do is search for my name. Hey, can you spell my name with me? <laughs> B-L-I-P-P-I, Blippi. Good job. Well, I'll see you real soon. Bye-bye. Woo! <laughs> It's me, Blippi, and today I'm at Synapse Circus Center in Auburn, Washington. Whoa, look at this place. Whoa, it is so colorful. And this place is where kids can come learn some circus skills. Oh, hey, who are you? I'm Coach Crystal, and I'm going to teach you some circus skills today. Yeah, I'm so excited. <laughs> the first thing you have to do is take off your shoes. Okay, I got to take off my shoes. Okay, here we go. One shoe, two shoes. All right, now that my shoes are off, now we get to learn. <laughs> Whoa, check this place out. It's so cool. Looks like we have a lot of cool things over here. Whoa, yeah, it looks like juggling balls. <laughs> we'll get to those later. Feathers, what are these doing here? That's <laughs> so silly. Whoa, look. Looks like tight wires. I am so excited to balance on these later. Wow, a trampoline, these are so bouncy. I really want to jump on this, but I probably shouldn't until I warm up and stretch. Yeah, whoa, look at this. Looks like a bar that you can hang on. Whoa, oh, an aerial fabric. Wow, what color is this? Yeah, this is the color purple. Oh, and over here, Another one! This is the color yellow. <laughs> okay, enough playing. Let's get warmed up so then we can stretch and have some fun. Oh, hey! Hi, Blippi, you ready to warm up? Yeah, I'm ready. All right, we're gonna run to the blue wall and then we're gonna run back to get our buddies all ready to go. Okay. Ready? Let's yeah. go! Check it out, I'm running! Whoa! All right, let's make our circle in the middle of the park. Okay. Arm circles backwards. We get our arms all ready to hang. 
hang on the aerial fabric and the trapeze. Whoa. All right, let's go forward now like you're swimming. Okay, check it out. I'm making big circles with my arm. All right, let's sit down in our butterfly. Put your toes together and make a butterfly. Oh, check it out. I'm flopping like a butterfly. Yeah, butterflies start as caterpillars. They go through metamorphosis and then they become beautiful butterflies. <laughs> okay, close your wings and squash them flat. We're gonna blast off to the moon. Grab those toes. Ready? Five, four, three, two, one. Blast off! All right, we're gonna do it one more time. This time we're gonna start at three, three, three two, two, one. Blast off! Whoa. Yeah! <laughs> All right, go ahead and stand back up. You feel warmed up? Yeah! All right, let's go do some circus stuff. Woohoo! Let's go! Whoa, that was really good. Did you see how high she was jumping? Yeah! Whoa! And look at what she's doing. <laughs> it is so cool how kids can come here and learn circus skills. Whoa, look at her! Whoa, she's using that aerial, aerial silk so good! Check it out! Wow, look at this area! This is so cool! Do you see these big pieces of paper behind me? Yeah, they have things written on them. Yeah, like goals. And once you accomplish that, you get to write your name on the board. Let's check it out! Straddle up in the air! Whoa! That means all these people that wrote their names on here, yeah, they accomplished that. Like Neil, Alyssa, Jonah, Zoe. Wow, good job. Whoa, let's see what else. Um, wow. Straight leg cartwheel. Whoa, that's hard. But look at all the people that did it. Whoa, that is so cool. Ooh, six club passing. Wow, now that is hard. Yeah, not one single person accomplished it. Whoa, that's crazy. Hmm, I have an idea. What if I pick one of these and try and accomplish it today? That sounds like so much fun. Um, oh, here we go. Stand up with no hands, forward roll. Oh, that seems fun. It's like a somersault. But then, at the end, when you stand up, you can't use your hands. Yeah, I think I should try that. This is going to be fun! Yeah, I did it! <laughs> Here's the pen! You can go write your name on the board now! Really? This is awesome! <laughs> yeah! Whoa! Okay, here we go. Now it's time to write my name. B L I P P I. Flippy. Wow, that was awesome. There are so many cool things. Whoa, what are these? Wow, kind of looks like a rainbow. Whoa, yeah, we have some purple. Whoa, purple rings. Whoa, check it out. Then we have some blue rings. We have some green rings. We have yellow. We have some reddish rings. They kind of look orange. Let's just say they're red. And we have some pink rings. Whoa, that is so cool. They're so colorful. Hey, what shape is this? 
yeah, a ring is a circle. Check it out. <laughs> whoa, maybe I can juggle with these. Here we go. Whoa, whoa, <laughs> I dropped one. <laughs> That's funny. Check it out. You can even spin them on your arm. Whoa, what if I tried that with a lot of them? This is gonna look so cool. Ready? Whoa, whoa, whoa. Whoa! <laughs> That's fun. Check this out. This is called a pancake flip. You can practice by going like this. Yeah. Try and make it flip. And watch this. Yeah! I did it! <laughs> okay, let me put these back. Can't forget this one. Okay, now that those are organized and put back in their place. Maybe we can use other things. Whoa, like this. This looks like a peacock feather. Wow, peacocks are so pretty. Huh, have you ever seen a peacock before? Wow, yeah. They can spread their wings out and it looks so graceful. But today, what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna take this peacock feather and try and balance it. Okay, put it on my finger. Whoa! <laughs> Check it out! Yeah, I'm balancing it. I'm trying not to drop it on the ground. Whoa! You can do it by standing in the same area or maybe I can do it while moving. Whoa! Whoa! <laughs> this is hard! <laughs> Whoa! Check this out. Ready? Try and put it on my nose. Whoa. Whoa. I'm balancing it. Whoa. Whoa. Yeah. That's so silly. While wow, balancing, it's so much fun. <laughs> what else do we have here? Oh, looks like we have some, oh, <laughs> some rods. And we have. some plates. How many plates did I grab? Yeah. One, two, three plates. And what colors are these? Yeah. Blue, red, yeah, and yellow. <laughs> okay, let's take the blue one, which is one of my two favorite colors, and give it some spin. Whoa, there we go. Yeah, you see it spinning and balancing? Yeah, well hey, these plates are plastic. You definitely shouldn't try this at home with your plates at home. If they fall, they'll break. Whoa, yeah, these are circus plates. Whoa, spin, 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 ready? Whoa, I'll try that again. Whoa, did you see that? Here we go. Oh, whoa. Oh. Okay, I won't try it again. <laughs> okay, let me put these back and see what else we have. Wow, check these out. So many juggling balls. Yeah, you know me, I sure do like juggling, don't I? Yeah, okay. Oh, they're so colorful. Check it out. That one reminds me of a bee. Yeah, bees are so great because they make honey. Yum, I love honey. Okay, looks like this is red and black and blue and white, green and black. Okay, I'm gonna pick three of these. How about these three. <laughs> All right, ready? I'm gonna start on my knees and start to juggle. Whoa! Juggling is so much fun. It's pretty tricky though. Whoa, whoa, whoa. But with a lot of practice, you can do a lot of cool things. <laughs> yeah! All right, now watch this. I'm gonna juggle this many. Ready? Okay, this is gonna be really tricky. Here we go! <laughs> that was so 
so silly. All right, I should probably pick these up. All right, let's see what else is over here. Whoa, check it out. Hula hoops. Yeah, I love hula hoops. Yeah, let's grab a few of these. All right, come on over here. Wow, I grabbed three hula hoops. Yeah, what colors are these hula hoops? Yeah, this one is orange, yellow, and red. Wow, <laughs> what a cool hula hoop. Yeah, and this one, yeah, is blue and a shiny silver. Whoa. <laughs> hey, what's your favorite color? Wow, that's a great color. My two favorite colors are blue and orange. And this one, yeah, is the color purple and the shiny silver sparkle. Yeah, let's use this one. All right, I'm gonna first try and spin it on my arm. Whoa, whoa, whoa. Yeah! Wee! <laughs> Woohoo! <laughs> Check this out. Yeah! All right, here we go. I have an idea. Now that they're on the ground, I think we should spread them out and try and hop through them. Yeah! All right. How about like a frog? Ribbit. Ribbit. <laughs> Ribbit. Ribbit. <laughs> yeah, good job. so much fun learning all these circus skills. Yeah! Whoa! Check it out! Yeah! Remember this? This is the tight wire. Whoa! Yeah! And you and I are gonna try and balance on this. It looks really hard because how small it is. Whoa! <laughs> Alright, let's try this. Alright, step right up here onto this platform and then you're gonna stand up so tall and walk through the rest. All right. Now, I'm gonna be right here in case you fall. All right, perfect. Here I go. Whoa. 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 Oh, I fell. That's okay. I'll try it again. Here we go. Whoa. I fell again. That was so much fun, though. All right, let me try for a third time. Here we go. I got this. Whoa, check it out. I'm really doing it. Whoa. Whoa. Yeah, I did it. Did you see that? Yeah, that was really hard. And it feels so good to accomplish something that was extra hard. Good job. <laughs> okay, first, I'm going to start with a roll. Here we go. Whoa. All right, now for the balancing. Whoa, 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 whoa. <laughs> now for the arm walk. Here we go. Whoa, 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 whoa. <laughs> yeah. Wow. This has been so much fun. Yeah. But this is the end of this video. If you want to watch more of my videos, all you have to do is search for my name. Will you spell my name with me? Ready? B-L-I-P-P-I. It's me, Blippi. 
And that was really fun riding a bike with you. Whew. I was riding really fast because <laughs> I was so excited to see you today. But you know, sometimes I ride really slow when I'm really tired. <laughs> hey, can you think of any animals or things that go really fast? <laughs> I like that. I think I can think of some too. Come on. Whoa. <laughs> you could be really fast like a rocket ship. <laughs> or like a horse. Ooh. <laughs> <laughs> that was pretty silly being a horse. Can you think of anything that goes really slow? <laughs> Ooh, okay, let's keep thinking. Whoa. You know what goes really slow? A Ferris wheel. Ooh. <laughs> and a snail. How do you know if something moves really fast or really slow? know you time it yeah you use a clock to see how long it takes for something to happen and I know the perfect place for you and I to figure out how things go really fast and really slow <laughs> this is gonna be so much fun let's go I'll see you there I'll race ya <laughs> It's me, Blippi. Whoa, and look at that. It's a really big ropes course. <laughs> yeah. Well, I'm so excited because today at Nona Adventure Park in Orlando, Florida, you and I get to go to the very top. <laughs> yeah. This is going to be so much fun. Come on. Before we start the ropes course, I think it's a really good idea to learn about all the right equipment to use and to get in a little practice. This right here, this is the harness. And it's really important to put the harness on. So if you're doing the ropes course and you fall off, the harness will get you. Woo! <laughs> That'll be fun. Okay, so we'll put this harness on, kind of like a belt. Put in our left leg, woo! And then our right leg and do the harness dance. <laughs> yeah, good job. And now you just tighten the harness like this, just like a belt. Now the next part of safety equipment we don't want to forget about are the clips. The clips are going to help us clip onto the ropes. Yeah, so we'll take this loop and we'll put it through the clips. Yeah, and now we're all ready to start practicing. <laughs> hey, I think it's time to go on the ropes course. <laughs> yeah. Whoa, that's pretty high up. Maybe it's a better idea to start off with something a little lower to the ground first, and then we'll do that next. Come on. Whoa, look at this place. This is awesome. <laughs> yeah, look at all these cool stools <laughs> and ropes yeah they're all different colors do you know what colors all these ropes are yeah this is the color red we have the color black Ooh. <laughs> and this one's one of my favorite the color blue <laughs> yeah whoa all of these different obstacles that i'm gonna have to walk on look a little bit wobbly whoa whoa <laughs> That's okay. You and I can use all of our balance to stay nice and upright so we won't fall. <laughs> okay, we're all ready to go on the ropes course. Yeah! Look at this. This one has a bunch of fossils for feet for little steps to step on. <laughs> Boing, woo, wee, woo. <laughs> Whoa, this one's really bouncy. 
Let's keep going. Come on. This rose course is so much fun! Hey, I think we've done such a good job that we can try the one all the way at the top! Let's go! This is gonna be so much fun! Wow, that was really tiring, but I'm excited for another one. Oh, hey, look! It's my really good friend! Hey, Jake! Hi, Buffy. Did you know that Jake is a pro athlete? Yeah! <laughs> He's really good at all kinds of sports and really cool things like ropes courses. <laughs> yeah! So, is it really hard being a pro athlete? It is, but it's a lot of fun. <laughs> That's cool. I bet you have to eat a lot of really healthy, yummy vegetables. <laughs> vegetables are important. One of my favorite foods is Brussels sprouts. Brussels sprouts? Ooh! One of my favorite foods is broccoli! <laughs> yeah! Hey, do you have a favorite food that you like to eat? <laughs> yeah, that's a pretty yummy food. <laughs> hmm. Well, this has been really fun doing this first rubs course, but I think I'm ready to try the one way up there. Whoa! <laughs> that sounds like a good idea. I got a timer, we can time it if you want. Yeah, that's a great idea. How about Jake and I? time doing the ropes course and see who wins. It'll be a blippy competition. <laughs> yeah. Okay, so who should go first? Why don't you go for it? Okay, I'm so excited. I'm gonna go first while Jake times me and then he'll go next. Come on.
Yeah, I did it. That was so much fun. That was really fast. That was awesome. Whoa, it was really tricky up there, clipping into all the different parts, and it took a lot of balance. <laughs> it was so much fun, I almost made a full circle. Well, actually, this ropes course is not a circle because it has six sides. Hey, do you know what a six-sided shape is called? <laughs> yeah, that's right. It's called a hexagon. Ooh. <laughs> well, that was really fun, but Jake, I think it's your time to go up to the top. All right, here's the timer. Okay, I got the timer. On your mark, get set, and go! <laughs> I can't wait to see how fast Jake can do the ropes course. be because you're a pro athlete and practice a lot. <laughs> Great job. You're the winner. <laughs> yeah. Bye, Jake. See you, Blippi. Woo. <laughs> hey. I have a really good idea. How about you and I race? Okay. Get the time on the clock started. Let's race. Hello! <laughs> Over here! Woo! <laughs> I'm up here! Hello! <laughs> Looks like you found me! Okay, here we go! Down the slide! Woo! Looked like you beat me. <laughs> that was really fun. Whoa. <laughs> Good job racing with me. Whoa, look over here. Hey, do you see what it says? Curiosity Corner. <laughs> it looks like it's time for the Curiosity Corner. <laughs> yeah, I am so excited because these are so much fun. I can't wait to find out what we're going to build together. Oh, look at the clock. Hey, I bet you and I get to build a clock today. <laughs> yeah, let's get started. Come on. Whoa, <laughs> look, we're here at the Curiosity Corner. <laughs> and it looks like we're gonna make an awesome clock. <laughs> okay, well first, what do we need to make a clock? Hmm, oh, I know, a circle. Whoa, it looks like this paper plate is gonna be a great circle. Okay, and we're gonna need a pen because clocks have numbers. Yeah, hmm. 12 numbers. So first, we wanna put the numbers down. And a good way to write down the numbers so they're all in the right space is to start at the top. The top of a clock has the number 12. <laughs> hmm. The bottom of the clock has the number six. <laughs> And then, to the right of the clock, we have the number 
three. And to the left of the clock, we have the number nine. <laughs> well, there's a couple more numbers on a clock, so I'm gonna fill in the rest. We have all the numbers of the clock. <laughs> yeah. Hmm. But I think our clock is still missing some things. Hmm. We have the numbers, but what points to the numbers? Oh yeah, hands. <laughs> hands. A clock has two hands, and we have some really cool paper here. My favorite colors, orange and blue. And all you need to do is cut out little arrows. Okay. You take our little arrows, we're gonna put them on the clock. Then we just pin them in. Now that we've finished our clock, let's see if we can tell some time. Hmm. Well, we have our big hand and our little hand. What does three o'clock look like? Yeah, just like that. A little hand is on the three. Hmm, what does six o'clock look like? The little hand, we move that again, and it's on the six. Hmm, I wonder what nine o'clock looks like. Oh, yeah, that's right. That's what nine o'clock looks like. A little hand is on the nine, big hand is on the 12. <laughs> that was so much fun telling time with you. <laughs> Yay! Hello! <laughs> Whoa! These circles are the same shape as a clock. And that gave me a really good idea. <laughs> Come on! <laughs> Whoa! I think you and I should do a really fun dance. <laughs> Just like a clock. We'll use the tick-tock of the clock for a really cool beat. And the hands of a clock. Woo! <laughs> for some sweet dance moves. <laughs> yeah! Okay, step one. We're gonna make our hands like this. Three o'clock, we'll move them to six o'clock, then back to three o'clock, and then to nine o'clock. <laughs> Whoa! And step number two is have lots of fun and be really silly. <laughs> I'm so excited to dance together. Let's go! <laughs> Is it? Three o'clock, six o'clock, nine o'clock, midnight, cuckoo, midnight, cuckoo, midnight, cuckoo. Double time. Tickety tickety tock, moving around the clock. Tickety tickety tock, doing the tick tock rock. Tickety tickety tock, moving around the clock. Tickety tickety tock, doing the tick tock rock. <laughs> I had so much fun with you today. <laughs> we learned about all kinds of things, like going slow means it will take a really long time, and going fast won't take much time at all. <laughs> it was also really fun learning about time and clocks, and that clocks have two hands and 12 numbers. <laughs> yeah! Well, this is the end of this video, but if you want to watch more of my videos, all you have to do is search for my name. Hey, can you spell my name with me? <laughs> yeah. B-L-I-P-P-I. -P -P -I. Flippy. Good job. <laughs> well, I'll see you real soon. I'm going to go play in the ball pit. Woo! <laughs> Woo! <laughs> Woo! <laughs> Woo! <laughs> Woo! Bye-bye! <laughs> so much to learn about. It'll make you want to shout, Flippy! <laughs> Whoa! Hey, it's me, Flippy, and I have a really cool fire truck here. <laughs> it looks just like a real-life fire truck with a hose and horns, honk, 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 <laughs> and some really big wheels and tires. <laughs> I think it would be so cool to be a real-life firefighter! <laughs> yeah!
Whoa! Look at it! It's a real life firefighter pole. Woo! <laughs> hey, let's slide down to the bottom. Okay, let's do it on the count of three. Are you ready? Okay, here we go. One, two, three. <laughs> Whoa, I'm a little bit dizzy after that. <laughs> oh, look at it. It's a firefighter. Hello. <laughs> I think it's a really important job to be a firefighter because they help save people's lives and put out fires with a really big water hose. <laughs> hey, look, that's another job you could be. You could be a pilot. Yeah, and fly really big airplanes. <laughs> hey, you could also be an engineer. Ooh, well, what does an engineer do? They're really good at math. Yeah, like adding up numbers and subtracting numbers. Ooh. And they plan all types of things so that other people can build them. <laughs> That's so silly. <laughs> hey, what do you want to be when you grow up? <laughs> that sounds really cool. I want to be that too. <laughs> hey, I have a really cool idea. How about you and I go to this place where we can pretend to do all kinds of different jobs? Oh, that would be so exciting and fun. And then you can pick your favorite job. <laughs> okay, will you go with me today? <laughs> yeah! Come on, let's go! I'll see you there! <laughs> hey! We made it to Great Explorations Children's Museum in St. Petersburg, Florida! <laughs> yeah! And I am so excited to learn all about jobs! Let's go! Woohoo! This is one of my favorite places. This is a pizza oven inside of a pizza restaurant. Whoa. One job that you can have when you grow up is to be a chef. Whoa. Chefs are so cool. <laughs> yeah, chefs are in charge of cooking all of the food at a restaurant. And I really like cooking pizza. <sighs> Oh, it's so tasty! Oh. <laughs> hey, I have an idea. How about you and I make a pizza together? <laughs> okay, here we go. First, we need one of these pizza paddles to put the pizza in the really hot oven because we don't want to touch it with our hands. Mm -mm. Okay, we'll get that and we'll get a metal plate. Hmm. So first things first, we need to start with the pizza dough. <laughs> yeah. We'll get the pizza dough right here. Ooh. And sometimes when you get the pizza dough, it's crumpled up into a little ball. So you have to stretch it. And sometimes spin it, whoa, <laughs> like this. And that helps to make it look like a circle. Yeah, look, it's a circle. <laughs> Good job. Okay, put the pizza dough down. And now we get to put on some yummy toppings. <laughs> hey. Do you have a favorite pizza topping? Uh, I like that one too. Okay, let's get started. Okay, we'll put on some tomato sauce. Oh, and my favorite cheese. Oh, <laughs> I love pizza with lots of cheese. <laughs> okay, we'll put the cheese there. And now we can put all the toppings. We have some spinach. Ooh, <laughs> so tasty. And we have black olives. Whoa. <laughs> And they're all sliced up. Yeah, put those there. We have, whoa, <laughs> woo. <laughs> Do you know what these are? Yeah, these are mushrooms. We'll put these on too. We'll put on some onions, ooh. <laughs> and then once you get your pizza made, then put it into the oven. You'll wait. And it looks like our pizza is delicious <gasps> and all done, <laughs> yeah. <laughs> and now we get to go put it in a box. Come on. <laughs> yeah. Whoa, you did a really good job making a pizza with me. And now it's my favorite part. <laughs> we get to eat the pizza. 
Mmm, <gasps> this pizza is really tasty. Mm -hmm. And that's because you helped me make it. Ah, <laughs> thanks so much. Wow, that was so cool learning about being a chef and making a lot of yummy pizza. <laughs> yeah! Whoa, look over here. Whoa, there are so many different types of animals. I love animals. Hey, do you have a favorite kind of animal? <laughs> yeah, I like that animal too. Whoa, look, we have some kitty cats. And we have, hmm, this looks like a really big puppy dog. Hello, puppy dog. <laughs> so silly. Whoa. Look, we have a really colorful parrot and a bunny rabbit. <laughs> yeah, let's go get a closer look. Come on. Whoa, look at this place. This place is a veterinarian's office. Yeah, a veterinarian or a vet. And that's a person that takes care of hurt or sick animals. <laughs> yeah. Whoa, look. We have some really cute animals here. Hello. <laughs> ah, this is such a cute puppy, but we want to make sure that this puppy is okay. So the first thing you can do is take it to get an MRI. Yeah, an MRI. It's basically a scanner that uses magnets to take pictures of this puppy, but not pictures on the outside where it's smiling. <laughs> pictures of all the stuff inside, like its bones to make sure they're not broken and this puppy is doing really okay. <laughs> Let's see. Okay, puppy. Whoa, look at it. The MRI is showing the inside of this puppy's leg. Whoa, that's pretty cool. <laughs> well, this puppy seems to be pretty okay, but it looks like it hurt its leg. So we're gonna take care of it. <laughs> yeah. Okay, here we go. The first thing we wanna do is put a bandage on its leg. So I'll use some dots. Oh, look, <laughs> we did it. We bandaged up this puppy. He's gonna be all better real soon. And the next thing we wanna do is give this puppy some medicine. Here you go, puppy. Up, up, <laughs> He's happy and feeling better already. <laughs> yeah. And the last thing we wanna do is we want to put this cone around its head because sometimes puppies get really playful and they take off their bandages. We don't want to take it off until he's all better. <laughs> he is so cute. <laughs> yeah, I love being a veterinarian. Being a vet with you was really fun because we got to learn about animals and take care of them if they get sick or hurt. <laughs> Whoa, this was awesome. What it is? It's a fire truck. <laughs> yeah. Whoa, fire trucks are so cool. And look at this. It has really big wheels and tires. Whoa. <laughs> and really bright headlights and a metal bumper. <laughs> I bet it would be really fun to ride in one of these. <laughs> Come on. <laughs> wow. It is so much fun riding in a fire truck. And look up here, yeah. This right here is the firefighter's siren. And it goes like this. Yeah, when a firefighter has to go and help people from a fire, they turn this on and they honk their horns. And that lets everyone know in the area that there's an emergency and they should move off the street. Yeah, so they can get there nice and quick and safely. <laughs> Whoa, and look at this. This is a very important part of a fire truck. This is the fire ladder. And it's really helpful for helping firefighters get up to really high buildings to save people and to use their hose to put out the fires. Oh look, and these are the valves where you hook up the hose but this is a really big fire hose. It's not like a regular hose you might have in your yard. <laughs> it's really, really, really powerful. To push out the fires 
and make everyone safe. <laughs> yeah, come on. Whoa, look at this. This is the fire pole. Whoa, the fire pole is really helpful because in a firehouse, the firefighters, they live up on the second floor and the fire truck is on the first floor. So the pole helps them not have to take the stairs. <laughs> yeah. Oh, can you see this? Yeah, this is a firefighter's uniform. It is so cool because it's fireproof. Yeah, if you or I were in a fire, that would be really dangerous because our clothes are flammable. They can catch on fire, but not a firefighter. They can go and save you because they're fireproof. Whoa, did you see the helmet? Yeah, look at this. This firefighter has a really cool yellow helmet. And that protects their head from anything that might fall on it. Ooh. Whoa, did you see this? <laughs> yeah, this is the really powerful fire hose. Whoa, this is so cool. There are so many different uh, adjustment valves. And look, it's really, really big so that it can have a very powerful spray to put out all the fires. <laughs> yeah. Wow, maybe one day you and I can be firefighters too. We can help save people. But to be a firefighter, you have to be really, really brave. Yeah, brave. Hey, do you know what being brave means? Yeah, when you're brave, that means you might be scared of something, but you do it anyway because you're gonna help, help people and keep them safe. <laughs> well, I really wanna do a job that will help people too. <laughs> yeah, that would be awesome. Woo! Look at where we are. Yeah, a job that you can do when you grow up is being a nurse. <laughs> yeah, being a nurse is a really great job because you help take care of others and make sure they get better when they might be sick. <laughs> Let's go see everything that a nurse does. Yeah. Whoa, look at this. Did you see it? This right here is a skeleton. Whoa, <laughs> there are so many bones. Yeah, bones. Do you know what a bone is? Yeah, these are different types of bones. And a bone is what helps make you up. Yeah, helps you stand nice and tall. Ooh, yeah, it's right under your skin. Bones are really important and it's important to take care of your bones. Well, it's really good to learn about bones because if you ever break a bone, you can go to a nurse and they can help you. Come on. Whoa, look at this box. It's really bright. Ah! <laughs> this will help us look at different kinds of x-rays. Yeah. Whoa, this right here, this is an x-ray. And it kind of just looks like a dark sheet, <laughs> but it actually is a picture of the inside of your hand. So when you put it up here, you can read the x-ray. Yeah, you can see all the different bones inside your hand. Whoa, and this is really helpful to take a picture, an x-ray of your hand, because if you break a bone, the nurse can say, hmm, you broke this bone and now we can fix it. Okay. <laughs> wow, x-rays and nurses are pretty amazing. Whoa, and look at this over here. Another thing you do when you go see a nurse is you see how tall you are. Whoa, look, I'm five feet and 11 inches tall. That's pretty tall. <laughs> hey, do you know how tall you are? Whoa, <laughs> that's pretty tall too. And I bet when you grow up, you'll be even taller. Maybe five foot 11 or six foot or six foot one inch or seven feet tall. Whoa, that's really tall. <laughs> Being a nurse is an amazing job. Maybe one day I'll be a nurse when I grow up and I can help make people feel better. <laughs> yeah. Well, this was really exciting. Hey, I'll see you in just one second. Woo. Hey, <laughs> whoa, that was so much fun learning about all those different types of jobs. <laughs> there were a lot of them, whoa. <laughs> Hey, which one was your favorite job? <laughs> yeah, I like that one a lot too. 
It was really fun doing that with you. <laughs> Whoa, look at this over here. Come on. Whoa, <laughs> do you see what it says? Curiosity Corner. Whoa, that means it's time for the Curiosity Corner, where you and I get to learn all types of things. <laughs> hmm, but I wonder what we're gonna learn today. I guess you and I are just gonna have to find out. I'm so excited. Let's go. <laughs> hey, welcome to the Curiosity Corner, where we get to paint a really beautiful picture together. <laughs> and it looks like we have everything we need. We have our paints. Ooh, <laughs> look, we have three different colors. Blue, yellow, and red. <laughs> These colors are really important because they're primary colors. And primary colors are used to mix, get mixed up and make every other color in the rainbow. So we're gonna use these to paint a beautiful picture. Well, we're gonna need our palette with paints and a paintbrush. Okay, so let's wet our brush first. Then we get the paint. Okay, so first we wanna make a really cool orange, because it's my favorite fruit and favorite color. So we'll start with some yellow. Whoa, <laughs> it's so fun to mix up the paints. We're gonna make a circle. <laughs> Whoa, look, we made a yellow circle, but it's not quite the right color. So now we're gonna add another primary color, red. Just a little bit of red and a little bit of water. And then you can mix it up to make an orange. Whoa, look at how pretty that color is. It has little bits of red and little bits of yellow and a lot of bit of orange. <laughs> Whoa, that was so much fun learning about colors with you and painting a really pretty picture. It's time for me to go wash out my brush. <laughs> Oops, looks like we got some traffic here. <laughs> Whoa! That was so much fun learning about all those different kinds of jobs with you. <laughs> Whoa, there were so many different kinds. <laughs> well, even if you didn't pick your favorite today, that's okay, you have all the time in the world. <laughs> Just keep on exploring and being curious and I'm sure you'll find what you will wanna do when you grow up. <laughs> well, I'm having a lot of fun with these trucks. This fire truck and recycling truck Whoa, and this construction vehicle with an excavator arm. <laughs> well, that's the end of this video. But if you want to watch more of my videos, all you have to do is search for my name. Hey, will you spell my name with me? <laughs> B-L-I-P-P-I, -P -P -I. Flippy. Good job. <laughs> well, I'll see you soon. <laughs>
use our feet for some agility. Ready? Yeah, go for it. Whoa. Really fast, Flippy? Yeah. Whoa. Oh, wow. Good wow. Good makeup. Whoa. Hey. A hula hoop. Yeah. Why don't you try hula hoopy? Okay. Here we go. You put it around your waist and you. Whoa. Three orange balls. Whoa, can you juggle? Yep, I can. Woo, yeah, whoa, whoa. Whoa, <laughs> whoa look at these. Huh, all right, what can we do with these? Hmm. I have an idea. Why don't we toss them to each other at the same time? Yeah, let's try it. Ready? Yep. Three, two, one. Whoa, whoa. three, two, one. Whoa. All right. Whoa, nice. whoa. Are we warming up the stretch? Yeah, let's do some stretches. All right. Yeah. Oh. Touch our toes. Oh. Oh, yeah. Feels oh. good to stretch. Yeah, it does. Ooh. Nice leg stretching. Now we're going to be able to dance really good. Yeah, I cannot wait to dance. <laughs> do you hear that? Yeah. It sounds like beautiful music. <laughs> I wonder if someone's dancing to the music. Let's go see. All right, let's go. Yeah. Oh, look. It's someone doing ballet. Yeah. That's what the music was. So pretty. She's really good. Yeah, very graceful. Yeah. <laughs> wow. Wow. Whoa, Whoa. so good. Yeah. Wow. Thank you. <laughs> wow. Oh. Who are you? Hi, I'm Miss Natalie. It's nice to meet you guys. Who are you? Hi, <laughs> I'm Mika. And I'm Blippi. Hi, Blippi. Hi, Mika. It's nice to meet you guys. Yeah. Nice to so, meet you. are you a dancer? I am. I'm a real life professional dancer, and I was just doing some ballet. Wow. Would you guys like to learn some ballet with me? Yeah. <laughs> Excellent. Um, come on over to the bar. We'll oh, okay. Get you guys all set up. Whoa, cool bar. Real what is ballet? this? Thank you. Uh, this is our ballet bar. Oh. Our professional ballerinas learn balances and how to be more flexible, all with this bar. Wow. So the first thing a ballerina needs to know is first position. You're gonna get those feet together nice and tight, okay. and just open up your toes like a pizza pizza. Pizza. And then stand up super tall, yep. And I like to only put two fingers on the bar so we're not putting too much weight on it, but just enough to stand super tall. Okay. Hello. Yeah. <laughs> now there are some ballet moves that we need to know because they're important, and then there are some that are just super fun. Oh. So we're gonna start with one that's important. Okay. We always use plie. Can you guys say plie? Plie. Excellent. We're just gonna bend down, but keep tall. Yep, and then set it back up, and then Whoop. down. And oh, Blippi, you look like a real ballet dancer. Yeah. Yes. Do you guys think you know what plie might mean? Sweet. Our knees do it when we do the plie. You're bending. Yes, that's so good. Plie means to bend. Oh, ah. that makes sense. We kind of look like frogs, though. Yeah. Like we're about to jump in exactly. the air. Exactly. That's what we're going to Whoa, really? Yep. We're going to take that plie and we're gonna jump straight up into the sky. Wow. And land back in that first position. Whoa. Wow. Yep, that and that really move cool. is called saute. Can you guys say saute? Saute. Perfect. Saute means to jump. jump. You got it. You guys yeah. are so smart. Whoa. 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 <laughs> so <laughs> good. Okay, another important one now. So that one was super fun. Yeah. Huh? Another yeah. important one is passe. Passe. You're gonna slide that toe up to your oh. knee, finding your balance, keep that knee pushed back, stand super tall, and you're gonna stand a little right back down. So it's kind of like an oh. elevator ride. Your toe takes up the leg. Do, 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 okay. do, do, do. Toe's going for a ride. Yeah. And then back down to first position. <laughs> okay. Whoop, 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 whoop. Excellent. Whoop, whoop. You guys are pro. <laughs> so good. Wow, that is really fun. One more at the bar. Okay. okay. Also super important. 
Okay. okay. Tondu. Tondu. Yep. It's kind of like what you did next door. It's the first thing I do in the morning. Ugh. It means to stretch. Oh, I okay. love stretching. Ugh. And it's for our leg and our ankle. So you're gonna stay in that first position. You're gonna do your best to slide that toe forward. Ugh. Keep your toe on the floor and then slide it back. Ooh. Perfect. Wow. And then use the other leg. Slide it forward as far as you can and stretch. Ooh. And then bring it back to first. Oh, that feels yeah. good. Yeah, yeah it does. Tom, do. Two, one, two, two. Excellent. Whoa. So that's to the front. But you can also go side. Okay. Whoa. And to the other side. Whoa. And you can also go back. Ooh. Whoa. And then you can connect all those tondus and make kind of like a circle around yourself. Whoa. Oh, this is fun. Yeah, it kind of feels like skating. Yeah. Whoa. We learned a lot of ballet already. Yeah. So That's many cool. words, huh? Whoa. Now we're gonna, if you can help me move this bar, I'm gonna teach you just like two or three more fun oh. words, and then we can put two music. Okay. okay. Whoa, 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 whoa. <laughs> Thank right. you. There we go. You got enough space there? Yep. Perfect. Okay, we're gonna stay in that first position. Okay. Feet first. are together, toes are open. Let's push our hands on our hips. Yes. <laughs> we remember saute. So saute means to. Jump, 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 excellent. So we're gonna Whoa. do eight super quiet sautés. Oh, ready? Now we're gonna jump open and close. Whoa. Whoa. This is right. called a chape. A chape. That's a new word. Yeah, it is. It's kinda like a jumping jack, so it's super easy. Just jump open, use that plie, and then jump close. You got it. A chape. A one more. A Perfect. Yeah. Nice. Wow, we did really so good. good. Can I give you one more jump? Yeah. Sure. Okay, instead of being in first, I want you to take your heel to your toe. Boop, 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 boop. This is called fifth position. Fifth. Okay. Yeah. So this jump, we call it shangma, and it means to change. So oh. all you have to do is jump up in the air and land with your other foot in front. Okay. Oh. Can we try? Yeah. One, Sounds tricky. Two, three, shans. No. You did Whoa. it. Yeah. <laughs> that was perfect. Let's try to do three shanjmas in a row. All right. Ready? Okay. Yep. Shanjma. Shanjma. Two. Shanjma. Perfect. You did it. Yeah. That was well awesome. Yeah. I'm so proud of you guys. You learned so much. Yeah. Thank you so much for teaching us. You're welcome. <laughs> I don't know, do we want to put it to music? Yeah, sure. that sounds fun. Yeah. All right, let's hit that music. All right. Ballet number, you guys. Oh, thank you so much for teaching us. You're so welcome. 
You know, I teach another style of dance too, if you guys want to learn it. Yes! Yeah. What kind of style is it? Tap dance. <gasps> yeah. yeah! That means we have to change our shoes and then okay. we'll come right back. Okay. All right, let's All right. go! Let's yeah. go. All right. Whoa! Wow. Yeah. You guys put your shoes on super fast. Yeah, I'm so thanks. excited. Oh, you did too. Yes. Wow. Thank you. Okay. Two important things to know about our tap shoes before we start. Okay. okay. The tap shoe has two metal shiny parts, right? Oh, uh huh. Wow, they do. Okay, we have oh. to learn what they're called. Okay. So up here, I mean, what's in that part of your tap shoe? Are your fingers in there? No. Oh, it's your toe. So we're gonna call this the toe. Okay. 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 The other part is called the heel. Heel. The heel. Exactly right. So the first few things we learn are gonna be super easy peasy. Put that leg out. Don't let it move. But you gotta tap your toe. Ooh, I love that sound. Excellent. Wow. Good. Can we try the other foot? Part of your shoe, but you're gonna put it behind you. Oh, oh. uh huh. It's called knock knocks. <laughs> yeah, like Excellent. knocking on a door. Let's try the other foot. <laughs> knock knock knock. Knock knock knock. Excellent. <laughs> now with the knock knocks, you can switch. Excellent. And then a new, another easy peasy moving one. 
is just like walking. Heel, toe, heel, toe. Heel, toe, heel, toe. You guys got it. Yeah. <laughs> That was really fun. Yeah. Should we try to put all those tap moves into a tap dance? Wow. Yeah. yeah! All let's right, cue let's get that some music, music going. Okay. <laughs> teaching us how to tap dance. You're welcome, excellent memories too. Ah, so thank you, you're a great teacher. Thank you. Yeah. You know, I have another teacher here who teaches another style of dance if you are up to learning one more style. Yeah! yeah. He Listen. teaches hip hop. <gasps> hip hop sounds really cool. Yeah, it does. Yeah. His name is Mr. Caden and he's just down the hall. Here, follow me. Okay, we're gonna get our shoes yeah, first though. Shoes. Okay. Well, here you go. <laughs> Mr. Caden, I'm a hip hop instructor here at Creation Station. Wow, that was really good. Yeah, that was Thank good. you. <laughs> do you guys want to learn some hip hop moves? Yeah. 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 Okay, well, first, do you guys know what hip hop is? Hmm. A type of dance? Yeah. Yes, it is a type of dance, but it's like all types of dance mixed together into one. Wow. wow. Cool. cool. Yeah, it's like ballet dancing and tap dancing and jazz dancing all put together. Wow. And there we have hip hop. Yeah. Yeah. Okay. Well, do you want to move, learn some moves? Yeah. yeah. Okay. Ready? First, yeah. we're going to dust off our shoulders. Ready? Huh? We're going to take our left hand and we're going to dust off our shoulder. Oh, like it's dirty. Yeah. <laughs> Ready? And then we're going to do it to the other side. Okay. And dust it off. Whoa. our shoulders. Yeah. <laughs> Whoa. Whoa. Yeah. <laughs> Wow, you guys are so good at that. Oh, thank you. <laughs> you too. Oh, thank you. Okay, ready? Do you want to learn another move? Yeah. yeah. So we're going to raise the roof. Raise oh. the roof. Ready? You're going to take your hands. You're going to place them up like they're on the ceiling. Like that. And ready? You're going to push the ceiling up. Whoa. Whoa. Oh, that's it's really deep. heavy. Yeah. Right? Raise the roof. Yeah. Raise the roof. Wow. Raise, raise the roof. roof. <laughs> raise the roof. <laughs> Perfect. Wow. You guys are really good at hip hop. Oh, thank you. <laughs> Ready? Another move. We're gonna put our pants on. Ready? All we do is we're gonna grab it and put it up. Oh, okay. Whoa. So ready? Oh. Grab your pants and put them on. Oh. Okay, we're gonna do it to the other side. Ready? All right. Grab your pants and put them on. Oh. Yeah. Let's try cool. one more time. Ready? Okay. Grab your pants, put them on. Whoa. Other side. Grab your pants, put them on. Whoa. Yeah. Oh, yeah. Whoa. <laughs> okay. Ready? Huh? We're gonna learn another hip hop move. Whoa! Whoa. So many moves! <laughs> <laughs> Ready? We're gonna do a hip hop slide. Do you guys like water slides or anything like that? Yeah! yeah. We love going down slides. <laughs> so much fun! Well, ready? We're gonna learn a hip hop slide. So, all you're gonna do, you're gonna take your hand and push it away. At the same time, you're gonna slide your feet over to the right side. Oh, oh okay. Whoa. Whoa. Whoa! You do the exact same thing on the other side. Take all your right. right hand. Push it away, left foot, slide. Whoa. Whoa. Whoa! Ready to try one more time. Ready, slide to the right. Whoa! Whoa. And slide to the left. Whoa! Whoa. <laughs> I messed up. <laughs> <laughs> Tell you okay. Yeah. Ready? We're gonna learn a super 
cool move. <gasps> okay. Yay. Okay. This is called a floor spin. <gasps> what? <Yay>. Whoa. <laughs> okay, all you're gonna do is you're gonna sit on the floor. Ready? Let's sit on the floor. All right. Okay. Ready? We're gonna sit with our feet out, just like this. All, all right. you gotta do, make sure you have all your weight on your hands behind you. Okay. okay. All your weight on your hands. Yeah, yep. I think so. Ready? All you gotta do is you're gonna push your hands around and then strike a pose. Whoa! Yeah! yeah. All right. Ready? Do you guys wanna well, try it? Yeah! yeah. Ready? Let's go! Ready? Go. And go! Whoa! Whoa! Whoa. Whoa. And ready? Strike a pose! Whoa! Yeah! Yeah, Mika! <laughs> that was awesome! That was awesome! You guys did so good! Thank you! Okay, now that we've learned all those hip hop moves, do you want to put it into a fun hip hop combo? Yeah! Okay, ready? Let's stand up and dance! Yeah, okay. Let's do it! <laughs> Woo! So, first, we're gonna start with raising the roof. Let's go! Okay. Yeah! <laughs> Woo! to the Blippi and Mika dance recital. Hope you enjoy.
Yup, ballet, tap, and hip hop. Yeah. <laughs> what one did you like doing most today, Mika? Mm. Oh, I really love tap dancing with those cool tap shoes. Oh yeah. <laughs> Well, I love tap dancing. That was cool. Yeah. Hip hop was awesome. Oh, yeah. And ballet was so beautiful. Yeah. <laughs> All three were so cool. Yeah. Well, this is the end of this video. But if you want to watch more of my videos, all you have to do is search for my name. Will you spell my name with me? B L I P P I. Flippy. Good job. <laughs> Wait a second. Mika, how do you spell your name? Oh, I'll show you. M-E-E-K-A-H, Mika. Cool. All right, see you again. See you soon. Bye-bye. Really? Whoa. This fire truck is so fast. <laughs> hey, it's me, Blippi. And today, we're here at the Caton Children's Museum in Santa Monica, California. I am so excited because we get to learn about all kinds of things. <laughs> this is gonna be so much fun! Come on! Ring! There are so many fun things to explore. Let's go! Whoa! Look at it! You know what it is? It looks like a garden <laughs> that's really fun to play in. Let's go inside. Look, there are so many different blocks and colors. Yeah, we have a blue cube <laughs> and hmm, a red rectangle. Ooh. <laughs> and we have a green cube. Whoa, <laughs> and they're so squishy and soft. Whoa, <laughs> they're so fun to play with. Woo! <laughs> It's a tunnel. I'm gonna go through the tunnel. See you on the other side. Ooh, ooh. That was a really small tunnel. <laughs> hey, do you know what kind of animal this is? <laughs> I'll give you a hint. This animal likes to go moo. <laughs> yeah, this, ooh, this is a cow. Hello, <laughs> it's so cute. Whoa, look at what it is. Do you know what that is? <laughs> yeah, it's a giant rescue helicopter. <laughs> I think you and I should go inside and check it out. Come on. Whoa, look at this place. It's so cool. Whoa. And this is the cockpit, <laughs> yeah. Inside this helicopter, there are all different controls of the helicopter. We have different levers and gears that tell you how fast you're going and if you have enough fuel, whoa. <laughs> and there's all types of switches on the ceiling. <laughs> whoa. I wonder what this button does. <laughs> Whoa! Whoa! And look, there are also a lot of really colorful lights that tell you what's going on. Yeah, we have a really bright white light and a green light hmm, and a red light. <laughs> well, it's time to take off. Okay. That was so much fun riding in this helicopter. <laughs> Let's keep exploring. Whoa, it's a giant fire truck. <laughs> Uh-oh, but it looks like it's missing part of its wheel. Hello, wheel. <laughs> Maybe we can find the other side. <laughs> oh, and there are so many cool levers. Yeah. Vehicles are amazing. Helicopters are kind of like fire trucks because they have different gauges, buttons that help control it and move really fast. <laughs> hey, I love the horn on a fire truck. 
Let's go inside and see if it works. I'm driving the fire truck. Make sure you buckle up. Okay, here we go. <laughs> Whoa! That horn was really loud. <laughs> Let's see what else there is. <gasps> Whoa! Look at this. It's a rescue boat. This rescue boat is on some really rocky waves. Whoa! Whoa! <laughs> it's so much fun. And it's squishy. Whoa! The waves are going so fast and they're so huge! Whoa! <laughs> Woo! Whoa! Whoa. <laughs> the water is nice and cool. Yeah. Because it's made out of a ball pit. <laughs> Woo! <laughs> This is so amazing. I really am having so much fun playing with you today. Hey, and look at this. It looks kind of like a really big picture frame. Yeah, it's a big square. Hmm. And it has some pulleys and a steering wheel. When I move this steering wheel, whoa. It moves up and it makes bubbles. <laughs> Let's see if we can make the biggest bubble with this giant bubble blower. <laughs> Whoa, <laughs> we did it. That was an amazing bubble, but it popped because that's what bubbles do. They get really big, and then, pop, <laughs> they pop. <laughs> this is so cool. It looks like mountains and oceans. And there's a little shark. Ooh. <laughs> <laughs> this shark is having a really fun time going through the ocean. It's so fast. Whoa! Whoa! <laughs> it did a big jump! Whoa! Whoa! And look at this! This is really cool! It's a submarine! <laughs> yeah! And it has its propeller that helps it move really fast underwater. And it looks like it has a scuba diver driving it. <laughs> Whoa! I think it's gonna swim with the shark too. <laughs> Look at this. See, when I press this big button, something really amazing and really wet is going to happen. Are you ready? Keep your eye over here and your eye over here. Here we go. I'm gonna press the button on the count of three. One, two, three. <laughs> Did you see it? Now let's press them really fast. Uh oh, looks like they don't like to be pressed really fast. There are so many cool things to explore with water. There's so many boats. Whoa, look at all of the boats. <laughs> There's so many. Yeah, we have one, two green boats, and we have one, two, purple boats. And we have, well, we have one, two, three orange boats. <laughs> These are so cool. And if you have an orange boat and a blue boat, you have blippy boats. Woo! <laughs> this is so cool. There's all these different water wheels and water. <laughs> Whoa. And looks like we can take this little island and move it all around. <laughs> bye bye, octopus. Hey, do 
you know what kind of animal this is? <laughs> yeah, this right here is a sea turtle. And it's so cute. <laughs> Whoa. Hey, look, I think I can get on the inside. Hello. Whoa, there's water all around me. <laughs> Woo. This is a really silly crab. There are so many animals. Whoa, but I think there's a really cool wall that we should go explore. <laughs> Let's go see what it is. Look at it. This is a magnetic wall. Yeah, it's a giant wall that's magnetic, which means squares like this that have little magnets will stick to the wall. So if you take the square, and you put it on the wall, no hands, whoa! <laughs> and sometimes the magnets are so strong, you can throw it and it stays by itself. Whoa, and you can make all kinds of cool shapes and pictures. Hmm, so let's see if we can make a picture. Move some of these out of the way. Start with a really big orange square. And we'll put it right there. And next, let's grab two more orange squares. Hmm. What color should I use next? Hmm, we already used orange, so let's use blue. <laughs> okay, now we're gonna go with one, two blue triangles. And Let's grab two blue squares, and we're almost done, but I think we should make two. Let's use an orange, and we'll use a blue one too. <laughs> yeah, it's a Blippi magnetic castle, King Blippi. <laughs> so silly. <laughs> Whoa, and do you know what this is? Yeah, look at it. This right here, yeah, it's a gear. Whoa, <laughs> look at it go. Yeah, and when you take a gear and you put one gear next to another gear, when you turn this one, the other gear will turn too. And now the really fun part. When you take one gear, connect it to another gear, you have two gears moving. But if you connect those two gears to the, all the gears, then they all move together. <laughs> Teamwork is really fun, especially if you're a gear. Whoa. <laughs> Are you ready? Let's use a lot of teamwork with the gears. <laughs> Whoa, look at it go. <laughs> They're all moving together, but I'm only touching this one right here. See, they're moving and helping each other out. Whoa, super fast. <laughs> this is so much fun. This place is amazing. And look above us. It looks like there's a tunnel in the ceiling. <laughs> I have had so much fun, but I think you and I should go up into the tunnel. Yeah, okay. Here we go! <laughs> Whoa, it's really tricky moving through these nets. <laughs> hey, I think it looks like there's a window over by the water area. Hey, look! It's a window, <laughs> hello. And it looks like the water area is a giant spinner. <laughs> Whoa, that's so silly. Huh, yeah, it's so cool because when we were down there, it just looked like some islands and some oceans and some water. But because we have a different perspective, yeah, a different perspective, that means a different way of seeing it. 
or a different way of looking at it. Yeah, we see with our different perspective that it actually is a giant spinner. <laughs> Whoa, this is so cool. It's so wobbly. <laughs> wiggle, wiggle, wiggle. <laughs> so silly. Wow, we crossed over the yellow bridge. And now we're all the way on the other side. Okay. This is so cool. It's a giant purple triangle. <laughs> yeah, because look, the triangle has three sides. One, two, three. <laughs> Whoa. Oh, look over here. Hello, I'm Blippi. What's your name? Oh, hi there, Blippi. Uh, my name is the amazing Andres. Ooh, nice to meet you, Andres. <laughs> Whoa, are you juggling? Oh yeah, I am juggling all right. Andres is really good at juggling. <laughs> <laughs> You're too kind, Flippy. You know, it's actually not that hard to juggle three balls. It just takes a lot of practice. Ooh, you know, practice. <laughs> great things start off with one ball, okay. like so. See, catching it good. And then, when I'm ready, I'll go two. And Whoa. then, when I feel really good, I'll throw in a third ball. Whoa. There we go. <laughs> that is amazing. <laughs> well, Andres, that is so cool. But what else do you do here? Oh, I do all kinds of fun stuff. I get to spend most of my time coming up with really cool ways for people to have fun here at this museum. <laughs> well, that's really good because we want to have lots of fun too. Hmm. Well, is there anything fun that we could do? You know, I got something perfect for you. Ooh. You like to make art? Yeah, I love making art. Hey, maybe we could make an art project. <laughs> I'm so excited. <laughs> got just the thing. Come over here, we'll go to the art crawl room. Okay. You're gonna wanna step in here first. Thank you, Andres. All right. All right, here we go. Look at where I am. We're inside of an art studio. Whoa, this place is so cool. And look at all the things that are here. We have all kinds of different paint where we can paint really beautiful pictures and make really cool artwork. Hmm. We have some pink paint and a lot of colors actually. Some black paint. Ooh. <laughs> And we have some green, ooh, and it's got some confetti in it, whoa. <laughs> and it looks like we have a lot of other colors. Hmm. We have, oh, this paint is gold and it's really shiny. <laughs> Maybe we can think of something really beautiful to paint with this gold paint. Hmm. But first, we need something to use as a paintbrush. Hmm. Oh, hey, look, <laughs> I have a brush and some paint and now we just need to think about what should we paint? Well, you can start with something really easy. Maybe make a gold smiley face. <laughs> One eye, two eyes, and a really big smile. <laughs> <laughs> He's so happy. Since we can paint all over this room, let's see how much we can cover and paint. Okay, I'm gonna paint all over the room. It's gonna be so fun. Okay, I think I'm gonna need two rollers and a lot of paint. Let's go. <laughs> Okay, now let's do it with some pink paint. Okay. Painting is so fun. <laughs> Especially when you can paint 
all over the place. <laughs> and get a little messy. But just make sure when you're painting, it's paper you're painting on and not the actual walls. <laughs> yeah, I like to paint on the paper, but not on the actual wall. <laughs> This was so much fun painting with you. <laughs> hey, that was so much fun playing with you here at the Caton Children's Museum in Santa Monica, California. <laughs> well, that's the end of this video. But if you want to watch more of my videos, all you have to do is search for my name. Hey, can you spell my name with me? Okay, here we go. B-L-I-P-P-I. Hi, Flippy. Good job. Well, I'll see you real soon. Bye bye. Hello. Hey, it's me, Flippy. And look at where we're at. Yeah, we're at SANCA, which is in Seattle, Washington. And SANCA stands for School of Acrobatics and New Circus Arts. Yeah. Have you ever been to a circus before? I love circuses, they are awesome! And today, you and I are gonna learn about some circus art. <laughs> wow, look at this place, it is so cool! And the floor that we're on is pretty bouncy. Whoa! Okay, the first thing I need to do is take off my shoes. All right, there we go. Let me put them right over here. And now, before we do anything with circus, we need to stretch. All right. Oh, whoa. Yeah, it's really important to stretch so then our muscles are nice and loose. So then we don't injure ourselves. Oh, yeah. There we go. All right. Woo. Oh, I stretched out my back, my legs, my arms. Oh. Now that I'm all stretched, I think we should learn the rules of the circus. Whoa! Check them out. The rules of circus. Yeah. Number one, have fun. <laughs> That's pretty easy. We love to have fun. Number two, be safe. Yeah, safety is really important. We definitely don't want to get hurt, do we? No. Number three, Work hard, yeah, I love working hard because it's so fun to start at one point and get to another. And the only way you can improve is working hard. <laughs> and number four, be kind to each other. I love being kind. It's so cool that you are kind to your friends and family. Good job. All right, now it's time for some circus stuff. Woohoo! Check out what I'm on. Woohoo! Yeah! Do you know what this is? Whoa! Yeah, this is a trampoline. Check it out. The bouncy part. Yeah, what color is this? Yeah, this is the color black. Oh, and look at this. A safety pad. Just in case if you go off the center and then you don't get hurt. What color is the safety pad? Yeah, it's the color red. <laughs> All right, let me jump. Woohoo! Can you think of an animal that can jump real high? Whoa! Yeah, how about one that carries its babies in a pouch? Yeah! Yeah, a kangaroo! Boing, boing, boing! Woohoo! What about one that loves to be in the swampy areas and it makes it sound like ribbit, ribbit? Yeah! Woohoo! <laughs> yeah! Jumping is so much fun! Whoa! Did you see that? That was awesome! <laughs> hey, Bleepy! Hey! How are you doing? Yeah, good! That was awesome! Thank you so much! What's your name? My name is Max! Oh, nice to meet you, Max! Do you know how to jump on the trampoline? I sure do! Will you show us? Yeah! Stay right here, kneel right here, and wait for me. Okay. 
Ready? are called aerial silks. Whoa, they're so cool. Yeah, and I am in a green silk, and Max is on a purple silk. Whoa, check it out. It's like I'm in a cocoon. Whoa! Yeah. <laughs> Can you think of an insect that hangs out in a cocoon? Whoa! <laughs> yeah. They start as a normal insect, then they go in a cocoon, they go through metamorphosis, and then they turn into a butterfly! Yeah! I'm a caterpillar! Whoa! Look at Max! He's the butterfly! Whoa! <laughs> Whoa, check it out! This is a tight wire. Yeah, this is where you can practice your balance. Yeah! And balance is really important because, yeah, you might need it for things. If you don't have any balance, you'll just fall over. Whoa! You see what I'm using on my hands? Yeah, these are sticks. Just in case, if I need a little help, Whoa, whoa, <laughs> that was silly. I just fell, let me try it again. Whoa, that's tricky. Wow, look at how good she is. Wow, she is so good. Hey, maybe now we can keep balancing on the balls. Wow, look at all these balls. Yeah, this is another great way to learn how to balance. Whoa, check it out. Look at this ball. <laughs> Whoa, whee. <laughs> yeah, I'm balancing on my stomach. Whoa, <laughs> that's hard. But hey, let's count all these balls. All right, one, two, three, four, Five, six, and seven. Do you see how this ball's in a circle? Yeah! This actually will stabilize the ball. So then when I try and stand on it, then it won't move around so much. All right. Okay. Let's try this. Whoa. I am so excited. Whoa. Whoa, whoa, <laughs> whoa, it's harder than it looks. Whoa, <laughs> whoa, if this stabilizer ring wasn't here, I probably wouldn't be able to do it. Whoa, <laughs> okay, let's see someone good do it. <laughs> been so much fun learning about all these things circus related. Whoa, check it out. Wow, looks like we have some really cool things like rings. Whoa, yeah, they're so colorful. Hello, hey. <laughs> Ooh, looks like we have some really light scarves. Wow, <laughs> and looks like we have this wood stick. Whoa, what is that for? And a plate? Yeah, a green plate. I know what to do with this. <laughs> Whoa. 
Or maybe, maybe I could juggle. Wait, he's not juggling. He's balancing. Let's try it out. Whoa, do you see how he just spun it really fast? Yeah. All right, I'm gonna put it on my fingertip. Whoa, check it out. Whoa, 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 that's awesome. <laughs> All right, get ready for this. I'm gonna put it on my forehead and see if I can balance it. Ready? Whoa, whoa, whoa. So silly. Okay, let's see what else we have over here. Yeah. Remember the scarves? What color are these scarves? Yeah. This one is the color pink. This one is the color orange. And this one is the color yellow. And you know what I like to do when I have three items. Yeah, juggle. Whoa. <laughs> <laughs> Whee! This is so cool! <laughs> yeah! I love juggling. Hey, speaking of juggling, maybe I could take these rings and juggle the rings. <laughs> First, what color are these rings? Yeah! A green circle, an orange circle, a red circle, a yellow circle, and a blue circle. All right. Whoa. Whoa. <laughs> Awesome. All right, let's take three of them. This is gonna be a little bit trickier. Here we go. Woo, how'd I do? <laughs> Whoa. Hey. Yeah, a giant circle. Whoa. Do you know what this is? <laughs> yeah. This is a hula hoop. Whoa. Whoa, check it out. Whoa, yeah, woo, woo. <laughs> oh, and watch this trick. When you spin it backwards, then it'll come back to you. Ready? Whoa. Ready? Max is riding a unicycle. Whoa, that is so cool. Yeah, it kind of looks like a bicycle. Yeah, but bi means two. Yeah, two wheels and tires. But unicycle, una means one. Check it out. Whoa, all of these unicycles have one wheel and tire. Whoa! That one, and this one. Look at this! This frame is the color yellow. Whoa! Wow! Whoa! Look at how small this is! Whoa! Whoa! <laughs> they are so hard to ride! Whoa! This one is so tall! Whoa! How do you even get up on this? <laughs> I don't even know. Whoa. <laughs> okay, maybe I should find one that fits me. How about this one? This one looks perfect. All right, 
let me try and ride this unicycle. Okay, do you see how I have these bars next to me? It's so then I can hold on. And when I'm learning, I can learn this way. And it'll help me balance. Whoa, whoa. Yeah, I definitely couldn't do this without holding on to these bars. Yeah, unicycles are actually harder to ride than bicycles in my, my opinion. Whoa, whoa, <laughs> whoa. Yeah, it's probably because on a bicycle, you don't have to balance forward and backward. You just have to balance side to side. But in unicycle, whoa, whoa. You have to balance forward and backward, whoa. <laughs> okay, I'm gonna try it with no hands. Whoa, whoa, <laughs> whoa, I almost fell. Let me try it again. Here I go. Whoa, 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 that was awesome. <laughs> hey, come on in here. Wow, look at this place. This is the fly room. Whoa, check it out. See all this? This is their trapeze setup. It is so cool. Trapeze is awesome. It's when people climb really high up in the air and then they swing while holding onto a bar. Sometimes they just fall down to the net and sometimes they grab onto other people. Hey, speaking of the net, check it out. Whoa, that looks like a really soft landing. <laughs> hey, come on. Wow. Hey, who are you? Hi, I'm Caitlin. Oh, nice to meet you, Caitlin. Hey, Caitlin does the trapeze here and she is really good. Will you show us some trapeze? Definitely. <laughs> about circus training with you. Did you have fun? Yeah, I did too. Well, this is the end of this video, but if you wanna watch more of my videos, all you have to do is search for my name. Will you spell my name with me? B-L-I-P-P-I, Flippy. Good job. Whoa! <laughs> wow! This has been so much fun! Woohoo! Yeah! Hey, it's me, Blippi! Whoa, and look at where we're at! Whoa, what a cool store! Hey, wait a second! We're at Allegro Performing Arts Academy in Kent, Washington! Yeah! Do you know how I like to dance? Whoa, yeah, wow. This place is where you can come and dance in one of their studios and you can even maybe take a dance lesson. Woohoo! <laughs> this is gonna be so much fun. Let's go. Oh, hey. Hello. Who are you? My name is Emily, who Ooh. are you? I'm Blippi, I'm here for the class. Awesome, sounds like so much fun. Yeah, what should I do? So you can go ahead and go back into the studio and I'm gonna be able to teach you a dance class today. Okay. So okay. go ahead and start stretching. Okay, let's go stretch and get warmed up, let's go. Whoa, check it out. This is a dance studio. This is where you and I are going to learn our dance from Emily. Whoa! Check it out! There's some nice smooth floor. Yeah, it's really shiny. <laughs> whoa! Whoa, whoa! Look at this! This? Yeah, this 
looks like a mirror. Whoa, hello. Hey. <laughs> yeah, dance studios have mirrors right in front of you. So then you can practice your dance moves. Woo. <laughs> yeah. Wow. <laughs> and see how you did. I definitely nailed that one. <laughs> okay, remember what Emily said? Yeah, we need to stretch and we need to warm up before she comes in to teach us our dance lesson. Okay, first things first, I need to take off my shoes. Oh, oh, oh so stinky. <laughs> okay, let's put them right over here. Now we need to stretch. Yeah, we need to stretch our muscles really far and wide so we do not injure ourselves. So first, let's stretch down. See how I'm stretching? Oh, I can almost touch my toes. <laughs> now we need to warm up, she said. Yeah, that means we need to get our body moving in some way or another. I mean, you could jog if you want. Yeah, you could jog. You can do some squats. <laughs> wow. Or you can just do some sweet dance moves to warm up. Yeah, that's what I like to do. Oh, hey Emily! Yeah, I love learning and I love dancing! <laughs> sure! Awesome! Would you like to see it first? Yeah! Okay, she'll show me the dance first and then I'll learn it! Whoa, that looks really hard, but I think I'm up for it. Will you teach me? Absolutely. Okay. <laughs> All right, so how we're gonna start is we're gonna start really close to the floor. So you wanna make a ball pose. You wanna get really close into your knees, right? Okay. Yes, from here you're gonna hold four counts. So you're gonna count in your head. One, two, three, four. Then you're gonna make a big star pose, jump your legs out, reach your arms way up to the sky. And you hold this for four counts, and we're gonna count it five, six, seven, eight. Then from here, you're going to shake your hips side to side with big arms, starting to the right side. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. Yes, now we're gonna learn what's called a grapevine. Yes? Ooh, okay, yeah. I don't see any grapes though. <laughs> Silly goose, it's a dance move. So oh, you're gonna okay. start with your hands on your hips. You're gonna step out with the right foot. You step out to the side. You cross this next foot behind, your left foot behind. Then you step out again. Then you're gonna jump together and clap on count four. <laughs> and then you're gonna step out to the side on the left. Step out to the side. Cross that right leg behind. Step the left foot out, out. Jump, clap together. Good. Okay. Then from here, we're gonna make strong arms down at our sides. You're gonna step, touch side to side. So you step out with the right foot, out, then step together with that left foot, together. Step with the left foot out, right foot together. Step right foot out, left foot together. Good. Step left foot out, right foot together. <laughs> Now, last thing we need to learn. You're gonna step out with your feet, hands are gonna go onto your knees. You're gonna bounce two times. Ready, you bounce. One, two, then you do two claps. Clap, clap. But it has to be at the same tempo as the music. Okay. <laughs> yes. So you bounce. One, two, clap. Now make sure your feet are nice and wide apart because we want to be confident when we dance, right? Okay, yeah, confidence. Absolutely. So we always want to make sure we have nice wide feet. Close feet, not so much. You want nice wide feet. So you do okay. want to try every single move nice and slow all together. Okay. All right. Now remember, we have to count in our head to eight. Okay. 
Okay, was that it? That was it? What was it? I just learned that full dance, and I think I'm ready. Am I ready? I think we're ready. Okay, right. let's hit that music. One, two, three, four, three. Shake your hips. Good job and good job to you. Thank you so much, Flippy. Yeah, well, thank you for teaching me and them how to dance. Absolutely. <laughs> hey, check this out. Emily's doing another dance. Come on. Whoa, this style of dancing is called jazz. It looks like so much fun! <laughs> you know jazz? Yeah! It's a type of music! <laughs> Check it out! <laughs> Whoa! Do you see what Emily's doing now? Yeah! She's doing ballet! <laughs> and she's actually using the ballet bar. Check it out! That is so cool, and this type of dancing is so elegant. Wow. Whoa! I have been having so much fun dancing today. Woo! <laughs> what? 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 Ah! <laughs> Do you like dancing? Yeah. I like dancing because it's a great way to get out your energy and exercise. Yeah, I love being healthy. Hey, I have an idea. Why don't I teach you a dance so then you and I can dance together? Would that be fun? Yeah! Okay, the first thing about dancing is what's called rhythm. Yeah, every song has rhythm. It's basically the beat. Okay, so what we're gonna do is I'm gonna clap my hands and then you clap your hands with me at the same time, okay? Ready? Good job! Yeah! You feel this? Yeah! This is rhythm! Yeah, we did it. Good job. Okay, so now I'm gonna do that again, but now we're gonna want to move our legs to the rhythm, okay? Ready? Here we go. Here we go. We got it. Double time. <laughs> Good job. Okay, now that we understand rhythm and beats, now we can learn the parts of the dance, okay? First thing, yeah, you see this up there? Yeah, what machine is that? Yeah, that is a bulldozer. So we're gonna dance as if we're bulldozers. First, you need to put your hands up like it's the blade of the bulldozer. Yeah. <laughs> okay, 
Then you need to move your legs and dance like a bulldozer. Yeah, there we go. We're totally like bulldozers. <laughs> I love bulldozers. Whoa. <laughs> okay, all right, so that's gonna be the first dance move. And then the second dance move, yeah, we're gonna act like kangaroos. Yeah, do you know what a kangaroo is? Yeah, whoa, <laughs> such cool animals. <laughs> okay, the cool thing about kangaroos is how high they can jump. All right, put your hands like this and then jump really high. Whoa! <laughs> yeah! <laughs> okay, I bet you can do that one really good at home. <laughs> okay, now the third dance move we're gonna do is, yeah, that's a dinosaur, isn't it? What kind of dinosaur is that? Yeah, a T-Rex, good job! Okay. So, the funny thing about T-Rexes are they have short little hands, yeah, like that. <laughs> but they're actually really fierce, so you have to act fierce. <laughs> okay, but now we need to put that all into rhythm and a beat, yeah, and then you act like a T-Rex. <laughs> okay, those are the three dance moves. But now, remember, we need a rhythm and a beat. So, hit it, DJ. Remember the first one? Yep. Bulldozer dance. Good job. <laughs> Plow the dirt. Wow. That was really good. I'm really proud of you. That was such a good bulldozer dance. <laughs> okay. So now we're going to go into the second dance move. Remember it? It was an animal. And it jumps really high. Yeah, a kangaroo. Ready? <laughs> wow. Wow, kangaroos are so cool. They can jump so high. All right, shake it off. Okay, now for the third dance move, the T-Rex. Ready? Rah, rah, rah. Rah, rah, rah. Rah, rah, rah. Did you see that? Yeah, that was so much fun doing all those sweet dances today at Allegro Performing Arts Academy in Kent, Washington. Wow, <laughs> I sure do love to dance. Hey, if you're around this area, you can come and do the very same creative movement class that I did today. Wow, that was so much fun. Or, yeah, I'm sure you have a local performing arts studio where you can learn to dance. Yeah, there's a lot of cool dances you can do, like jazz and tap and ballet. Whoa, even acro. <laughs> that sounds like so much fun. Well, this is the end of this video, but if you want to watch more of my videos, all you have to do is search for my name. Will you spell my name with me? B-L-I-P-P-I. -P -P -I. Blippi, good job. All right, I'm gonna go and take a nap now at home. I am so tired. Oh. <sighs>